Hi guys, it's Strategist Primus here, and I'm back with another episode of the Blackfire series. As we all know, uh, Blood Raven is coming. I am a little uh, not wanting to deal with this, so I'm just going to just see what kind of a plot to kill we can have on this guy because I do not want to deal with Blood Raven. He's a bad motherfucker. All right, not bad, pretty decent. Watch the kids where he's hiding out. He's not exactly a popular guy. Oh, bugger off, Marin. I'm tempted to revoke his royal privileges for this. Alright. 60%, that won't trigger very easily. I'd have to start bribing people, and I don't have that kind of money right now. So I'm going to ignore that. And just deal with them. We can probably crush him. Hopefully. Seeing the factions, everyone wants to dare on, not Blood Raven. So, hopefully we'll have some supporters here. My problem is, uh, Martel here wants to uh, support uh, the former king, as does the Belmore, which is a problem. Belmore really shouldn't. He should love me and hate Darren. What what the hell is this? Linda Rude, what, what is wrong with you? I don't know why he's attacking the Night's Watch. I'm ignoring that. One more signs of the laziness. I oh, know you don't. There we go. All right. Y you should bugger the hell off, man. Don't don't make me. All right, we're whacking them. It's happening. I've had it with this Martel. He's a Targaryen supporter, and he's dealing with this sort of a problem. Uh, the Florence want me to help him against the Peaks. Not happening. Alright. Let's see whether or not I can actually whack the Martel. And yes, I know uh, Damon Blackfire would be unlikely to want to just start whacking people, but I'm pretty sure if he was sitting in King's Landing with as many enemies as I'm pretty sure he has, uh, he might get a little bit paranoid. Besides this way, if we uh, whack the father, uh, my son Annie is, is going to be uh, the one basically inheriting Dorn. Oh, not quite. He's going to be in a strong position to have his wife inherit. Respecting wealth. Oh yeah, I'm going to reward Agar. Better steel is going to be necessary in the coming conflicts. I'm almost sure of this. Huh? I have a granddaughter. Lay in a better steel. Good enough. My ketting is dead. So that means Lord Alvin Greyjoy is uh, well, orphaned. Some of these. Younger brother is going to be a problem for him. Formidable fighter, skill commander, strong claim. Yeah, I, I, I predict a great of civil war right here. Now over here, we're at 104. That's not bad. I'm gonna go bribe Freeborn. I don't have money for that yet. Never mind. 104 should trigger. Plot. Increase the plot power. Just so we can get rid of this pesky Dornishman. Why A want nothing to do with B want nothing to do with. I'm keeping him in prison so these people don't rise up. Uh, Makar is on the wall so he won't inherit any of those claims. Ares is the one who bid, as well as the sons of Breakspear. Vlar might be a bit of a problem. Not really sure about Darren here. He might be, but he's craven. Uh, I don't like that. 
too many Targaryens are around. And Blackfire. And, uh, sorry, not Blackfire. I'm Blackfire. Blood Raven's coming. 207 on in August. So we have about a little over a year. And I'm trying to get to that in this episode. So I want to deal with Blood Raven. Somebody just got burned at stake. An epic Gorman, who is very likely a uh, demon worshiper. Now that I'm looking at his stats, lunatic, suddenly ugly and hunchback and a torturer. I prop up the best people under me. Civil war in the Lannister region. So Lannister rather does approve of me, considering his uh, father was killed in battle by a Westerling. I'm going to tell her to stand on. I, I could not care less, but enjoy. Here, I'll give you a guardian so I don't have to deal with you. Hey, Gore. Deal with this kid. I don't know why I just gave it a bitter seal. Felt right. And this should be us whacking the Dornish. Any second now. And didn't work, but at least no one knows that I did it. I just realized that Marin here is infirm, so that's just hilarity and parallels. As the current Martel is infirm. And yes, it is his heir that has been married. No, it's not. What the hell? Kinetic primogenitor, so it should be Sorella. Ah, disinherited. Good. He actually caught it. That's good enough. Yes, the Dornish will disinherit the oldest daughter occasionally. Oh, he got murdered. Wrong Dornishman. Darren is a man. I'm gonna knight him. Rise. He's Maker's son. Makers possessed, jeez, that's that's just great. Who is the Clerk Commander? Still the open handed. His heir at the moment is Donald Aaron. That's just gonna be great when he's uh, Lord Commander of the Night's Watch. That's that's gonna be perfect. Ah, uh, jeez. Morella Blackfire. Go for that one. Over here. I'm going to make her an Intriguer, because she's very good at it right now, and that will just make her better at it. And she's set up to marry the heir of the Stormlands, so let's make her not bad. He's growing up to be a man of honor. I'm absolutely sure that Damon here would approve of that. Wow, and he just got brave, and now he's a skilled fighter. This is going to be a good guy all the way around, because he's got strong diplomacy. He's focused in diplomacy. He's a strong marshal from bravery and skilled fighter, and strong. And he has good stewardship. He's going to be a force to reckon with. He's also way down my line. Oh, he wants to go to the Citadel. I mean... But, but, but... But, son, don't do that to me. All right, fine. You you want to go be a maester, but you're a knight and you're good. But ah, fine, go. Upset your father. He's trying to be a shitty son on me. Aemon shittier. Another stillborn. Jeez, and my daughter's had a bastard with Hagon. Of course, this is going to be great in the next generation. Oh, man. Hagon, why'd you do this? Really? Oh, man. That's going to be a problem. Just made my son keep his swans. Nothing for now.
Let's hope cows will stand down. Uh, she might die. The original Daenerys. I'm gonna use his Valyrian features even better. <sighs> Seriously. Hang on. Why? Ugh. Really? Aegon's gonna have some problems. Hmm. Interesting over there. Oh, come on. I'm gonna deny that because I want Blackfires to stay with Blackfires. Come on, adventure for a tick already. A couple more days. Couple more days. More elegance, more stewardship. Born in the West. To the Lord of the West. So the previous Lannister was killed in a tournament. So we have the third Lannister, Lord Paramount of Casterly Rock, while we've been playing. Uh you're you're so under curfew because I'm not letting you be arbitrary, crew. You got Craven. Come on, Aaron. Why not? Good. High Garden, so now they're going to have some problems. That's going to be entertaining. I'm going to let that happen. Okay. Who just died? Maycar just vanished without a trace. So that's always an interesting sign. I've not seen that happen before. You got killed by Matthew of Harrenhal in battle. That's gonna be interesting. So these Lostons are having a bit of a problem. Okay, what gives with I'm black. What happened to Blood Raven? He should be coming, right? He appears to have abandoned his attempt. Maybe he got wise. Arion gains brilliant commander. Which is kind of meh. Arion Targaryen is a useless steward. Mary's Targaryen is a skilled commander. So the next generation is beginning to uh, fill out as my son, my daughter, and my other son are just having the uh, most wonderful sibling relations as they're probably going to murder each other. That's just going to be fun. And uh, Ares here is determined to go be a maester. <sighs> Since he's got foul impulses, as much as I want to get him to die in prison. Bitter steel? No, 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 no. Really? Egor, come on, buddy. You, you don't want to be king. I'm the king. Make him like me more. A bit of bribery. You don't want to be king. Come on. This Lannister... would like Darren and his leech less. I don't know why he's joining this faction. It's very strange. Sorry for the background noises. I had to fix my chair. Got weird on me. Going after this broom in a tournament. I should totally be able to kick his ass. We're going on 40 now. It's been quite a while since the rebellion. Well, started at least. It landed a little while ago. Hit. Feels good to be recognized. Fine hit. Good. And I have knocked him off. Next up is Rob Rain, who is considerably better than the previous dude. But he should be worse than I am. And knocks me off anyway, because it's Rob Rain. Okay. 
I at least reached the final round, so that's not bad. And Rob Brain went on the wind of the damn thing, so, you know. Good job. Uh, so, the Stark in the North just inherited her title before she could marry my son here, which is a bit of a problem, really. Because um, she's now likely to decline that. Damon had a daughter. Danies. That's fun. Fine competition. Is that my first actual black fire? Yeah, I think so. That's my first actual black fire granddaughter. And I'm 38. Ah, uh, Game of Thrones. Ugh. He just got grisly murdered. Going with the cruel. Brathian? Yeah, I don't, don't want to mess with him. Plays hard and talks straight. I'm wanting him to be brave, though. Just because it'd be funny. To have a better couple of Targaryens down here. See what they try to do. I'm annoyed that Blood Raven didn't actually go through with his plan. Hmm. Maybe he knew he wouldn't win. Who knows? I still don't like this. His faction here is at 41%. It's three Lord Paramounts. That's not good. Rella is gaming diplomacy. Uh, I'm throwing this dude in the oubliette. I want him gone. Uh, Chairman Stokeworth, good. Ah, another granddaughter. As this one. Oh, yeah, that's already stored. Good. Yeah. That bastard. Uh, this. Uh, what is. Oh, Lofton actually managed to have a kid. That's impressive. Pray for fertility, apparently, to the mother. One north. Fall lady in the north. Her heir is the Stark Borthigan Black Sword, who is her uncle. I'm seeming to run out of Starks here. Yeah, we are running out of Starks. Yeah, there's only a couple of options for the stars to go on. I'm pretty certain that that uh, arranged marriage is going to fall apart, given the fact she now has the wardenship of the North, which is bad. Dolan here and I get a pleasure of jousting. I should knock him off easy. Hit. Yeah, he's definitely a devil worshiper. All these bad traits coming out of nowhere. That would be entertaining. <laughs> yep, my daughter's becoming authoritative. And hopefully you're Gary's? Yeah, Gary's too. Good. Knock him off this time. Hit. So now he's acquired High Garden. Yep. He's the High Lord of it as well. Peaks powerful. His line's pretty secure. Dolan hit. Yet again. I'll knock him off this time. Yet again a hit. Come on, knock this dude off. Good, good. No one can beat me. I uh, now I have to face Mathos. It's gonna be a problem. Oh dear. Really? Oh well. And yet again, I make it to the final rounds, so I'm an average jaster. Shame I haven't been able to kill anyone in battle yet. I don't know why he called it off. 
no idea. Come on, let's get this sucker. This costs way too much. Let's go bribe him instead. That should get us some options here. 120, that should do it. Range marriage between Lionel Baratheon and Morella. I accept. In case some of you are wondering why I'm not. Uh, blood marrying all of my my children together it's uh, bad for the general health of the family um, due to the fact that uh, you will get certain negative traits more common uh, more common to get what the hell again really <sighs> you get more negative traits more commonly uh, by inbreeding like this uh, lunatic will go through the roof and several other issues will occur. However, if dragons are to come around, you kind of want the blood purity, so that's why I'm doing it. I just don't want to do it as much. Daenerys, what the hell are you doing? <sighs> We're in a storm here. We don't know who his father is. Well, Thorn just got gruesomely massacred there. I'm gonna tell this Ma Mallory to stand down if I can. Hmm. Ah, there it is. And of course I'll travel to the wedding. You shouldn't be too likely to read a wedding, way. But who knows? Do nothing for now. Jeez. Gorman just burned somebody else in the stake. That's just ridiculous. Thank you for having us. I've made friends with this swagert. And Materi is now a knight. And winter comes to an end. The feast is winding down, and now only the bedding remains. Lando Marind and Morella are stripped of all garments by the revelers, who make many body a joke along the way. They are then finally bundled into their bedchamber, where they are finally left alone. A fine tradition. Would be another wedding. I'm going to call it there. Uh, Blood Raven has appeared to have buggered off to the east again. Uh, we're still busily trying to murder the Martell because he annoys me. Although old age might get him first. And uh, we appear to have a demon worshipping supporter. Who knows? Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate the support the series has been getting. I'll see you in the next one.